We did it! Welcome to the Wizard of Legend 2 demo! Thank you for joining us at Steam Next to Festo. We hope you enjoy your adventure. Options. Start G. Just go straight in. Start the game. That one. I had a lot of fun with Wizard Legend 1. I enjoyed it quite a bit. I believe I unlocked everything. Or I'm close to. I did find the late game stuff you could unlock. The special, like, fifth school of magic was a little overpowered. My favorite demo so far is probably Dungeon Clar. I'm looking forward to that one. So far, my favorite has been maybe Dungeons and Degenerate Gamblers, but it's very closely tied, I think, with um, Metal Slug Tactics was very good. I hate how they made this look. Super generic. Yeah, I, I prefer the art style quite a bit in the first game, and I do agree with you. I think with their new 3D engine, it does look a bit more generic. It doesn't uh, it doesn't sing to me like it did in the first game. Ladies and gentlemen, Wizard huh? Legend Wannabes, welcome to the trial. There's a skeleton over there. I'm Madame Moulin, your commentator Moulin. extraordinaire. So grab your arcana and hold on to your relics. I just want to games begin. Don't like the feel of the game. Might be a skill issue. I would say you have to uh, get a little into it because once you realize how the deck works and how the cards work and how you use your advantages, the game opens up quite a bit. Yeah, your skeleton. Are they enemies? Just little baby spiders? Step right, on them for it. fun. It's showtime. Teach them a lesson. Oh, I don't have a dash ability yet? Oh, there we go. But it's not a spell anymore? It's just a normal dash? Looks like those enemies never stood a chance. Oh, I see. We could shoot up to ten. There is still a cooldown on it. Cooldown runs out at six. Okay. You like how the spells look? Get good at degenerate gambling, like me. Yeah, yeah. Dash used to be its own spell category. I hope we could still, like, change out how the dash works. Having neato dashes was part of the fun. Alright, can go in two directions here. Oh, the blue bar beneath your health gauge represents the signature bar. When it's completely filled, your signature arcana becomes charged. Activating signature arcana consumes the charge, allowing you to unleash its full power. Once the signature is full, it gradually diminishes over time and is lost if left unused. Okay, so use it when it's ready. Now, uh, is there a button associated with this? Is this a thing? No. Our wizard is stepping into the ring. Arcana at the ready. Uh, uh. Sparks are about to fly. Scary. Why didn't it fill up for this room? This is where I needed my signature. Was that a different thing? What did I just do there? Whew. 
Oh, there's another one. Now. I gotta remember, I gotta hold down that uh, dragon one. I feel like the UI is a lot smaller in this one as well compared to the first. I'm having trouble noticing my cooldowns way down in that little corner. Oh, oh. Excuse no, 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 no. No, 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 no. no. Over here now. I'm not sure why my ice attack is sometimes different. It's not that blue bar down there, right? Because that was different the other time. Or maybe it was. I think it is the blue bar. Never mind. I take that right back. Ah. Oh. We all dead? All right. Archelith statues are scattered throughout the floating lands. Those hold the reward for clearing a level. Remember, if you don't touch the Archelith when you're done, you won't get your reward. I will touch it. Increase the damage of basic Arcana by 15%. Gain a shield that freezes nearby enemies on being hit. If you have more than 250 golds, damage will scale by 15%. I think I'll just go for a flat... 15 on my basic arcana behold the fist of the magi a relic discovered in the ancient ruin far from here despite the grand name it was actually made to empower the most basic of magical abilities is he gonna be okay he's breathing in there is that me he's wearing my clothes oh you're me too all right bye I see my health is still at 15. I should have been careful. Bang, bang. Now, how do we heal in this game? Because I am uh, grievously injured. I remember you from the first game. Rising merchants have set up shop within the floating lands. A word of warning, wizard. They've all taken a vow of silence to prevent haggling. Ah, boo! We didn't give anyone voice lines. Dashing through enemies will burn them. Ten percent more damage for each status effect on an enemy. All right, I'm at. Fi I need a hundred more golds. Or I just need 25 more if I want to heal myself. I'll be back. Don't go anywhere. Is there a map? Can I bring up a map? Really? There's no map. That is strange. An odd choice not to have a map. Fifty-two golds. Fifty-four. Give me your money. Want to heal. Money? Almost there. Almost. Spiky floor? Ah. Oh. All challenges terminated. Oh, even better. Just found now some normal health. To page 332 in your textbook. Uh, wait, I don't have a textbook. What an egregious oversight. Yeah, where's my textbook? It's an unsafe testing environment.
enough to go get health. Oh. Didn't hit the button on time. So I get for taking my hands off the controller. You mind if I break all your stuff? Are you are you alright with that? Let me know when I'm breaking things I'm not supposed to break, all right? Hitting enemies with a standard melee attack heals you. Thanks. All right, bye. Given that this is only version 0 0.2, I assume we could uh, expect that eventually there will be stuff like maps and things. Do I get to open my chest? Can I open my chest now? Thank you. It's the Sunblade. Burn damage affects an area around the target. I forgot up there, but there's also down here. If I were able to look at a map, I can make choices. Oh, nope. There was no choice. That was a dead end. Freeze! Still have room for two more spells? I wonder what buttons they're gonna be. L1 will be one of them. Will be Congratulations. Now get B? ready to do that for every section in the jungle, desert, and castle biomes. After that, you will face Hieronymus in battle and become the new Wizard of Legend. Simple. Oh. Uh, hi? He was just standing there. How was your chicken cutlet? <laughs> there was much suffering. God, could you stop? Every time I've managed to hit him with my ice thing, he's been immune to being frozen or he dashed to the other side of me. God, that hurt. Breakers of Tiamat! Water dragons rush forward, creating waves of water. The might of a dragon is a potent thing. 
but the right trigger of a dragon is even more potent try to channel that too 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 so I just murdered a, a, a fellow wizard just because he had stuff I wanted hi this elemental may be down to earth but they lack your education and skill oh, oh I see multiple punches Let's check the next wizard at Lenova mansion do, 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 do. Some some sort of wizards le legendary wizard or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Shouldn't Hieronymus's mansion be bigger, more magical, and cleaner than this? Once I become the wizard of legend, I'll scatter magical props all around. Oh boy! And perhaps install a magical disco ball. Oh hell yeah! To make sure to pick clean them corpses' pockets. Pockets? How about we focus on where to dump them first? Running out of grave here. Are these wizards dead? No, they're all just having a little lie down. Lie down. <laughs> Playing around of nap in the box. Who do you think you are? Tombstone tricksters, coffin comedians from the Bureau of Burial Clowns. Show some respect for the dead. Dropping like flies, they are. How much respect can Kotors, why are you here? Paying respect, respect gathering, gathering the, the corpses. corpses. How many times must I meticulously specify? The main courtyard is off limits. I like these birds. Return to your task immediately. Welcome to the mansion that oh, trap the one. Banish those negative thoughts. Allow neither fear nor hesitation to undermine your bravery and determination in facing the trials ahead. The trials of legend are long and arduous. I feel like the demo should have started here. Surely triumph. I hate to bring this up now, but can I return for the next round of trials? I don't think I'm ready this time around. Oh, we can choose. Select one of the registered wizards. Moldeon's gem for Shasha. Receive healing equal to 10% of the gold received. Cyrilina has the thunderbolts. Every time you get hit, an explosion shocks nearby enemies. Soleron has the burning hat. If I get hit, we burn enemies. If I get hit, we shock enemies. Or we receive equal health to golds. Well, 10% of golds will heal. More healies or hurt things that hurt us. Hmm. Just getting light heals. All right, bye. Classic. You got brooms that broom themselves. Classic, classic stuff. Classic. Yeah, we got three people to chat with. Yeah, or just don't get hit. What's this do? Ah, yes, the observatory, where foolish wizards gather to watch other more foolish wizards fight and die. If what you see in this orb scares you, you can always turn. Ponder the orb. There's no shame in choosing life over glory. But you don't care about that, do you? You want to be a legend. I want to be the very best. From the observatory, I can see the wizards still wandering in the forest. Wizardry lacks the seriousness it once had. It's merely a game for everyone, and they're not particularly strong at it. Despite all the arcana cards I've provided in the trials. You tell him, Nazrudan. We need a more exciting show. 
Mm, I need to personally oversee your run and see what's going on. Psst. Wizard, do you know anything about the last wizard who made it to the end of the trials and disappeared? Hey, that was me. Oh, crap. My Aunt Mulan is watching me. The apparatus is amazing, right? This beauty is my favorite part of the trials. Over there is the yard. This is the main hall. This Behind is the giant hourglass. From which you can enter the trials through the portal. Honestly, why am I explaining these obvious things? The echo gems are installed throughout the mansion to inform wizards about everything they need to know. Thank you. What's this? Don't knock on my door, you idiot. I want to sleep. What's going on, Joe? This is the Wizard of Legend 2 demo. Same three starting spells. Ah. Arcana serves your primary combat abilities. These mystical cards are inscribed with preset spells and infused with magic, enabling swift and effortless spell casting. <clears throat> Fire, lightning, earth, water, air, and the special one that I don't remember the name of that was overpowered in the first game. Wonder why? Wonder if they explain why everyone dies in this trial, but they didn't in the previous one. I remember the first game was. You're in the museum, and you go back in time to before, and you create the events that, like, the museum are built around, which was fun. We got Earth Knuckles, Aeromancer's Fingers, Fireball, Projectile, Melee, Melee. Two Melees and one Projectile. I mean, I've already tried the fireball, so we might as well try something different there. And no one died in the trials. Now they're dying all over the place. Wonder what changed. Good question. Melee, ultimate. Melee, ultimate. Melee, ultimate. Well, I took uh, a rock melee, so for my signature I'll take wins. What's going on, Lion? We got the water one, the dragon one, the Vawi, lightning spear, terror ring. Take some lightning. Wow! Woo! Oons, 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 oons. How's next fest going? Going all right. We've only done one other demo so far today, which was Red Snow, but yesterday, yesterday we had a few winners. Paintbrush, what are you? Dungeons and Degenerate Gamblers and my boy Metal Slug Tactics were the best ones yesterday. Better arcana cards means better chances in the trials. You're here in the trials. Choose whatever arcana you Surgic want from the tome and become a wizard. Practice the arcana you choose on the dummies. Are you a dummy? Ha <laughs> ha! Got him! Hey, right, bye. Hey there, I'm Nasreddin, your commentator in this run. Oh. So, get set for a whirlwind of magical chaos and <laughs> unexpected <laughs> gems. For demos? Right now, we're only doing demos. But yeah. The only demos I got on the wheel are ones that were suggested by chat. <coughs> and behold, the stage is set for a delightful spectacle of spell music. Push, push, push.
Oh, big rock. And thus concludes our skirmish. With our wizard emerging triumphant, like a phoenix soaring from the ashes. Yeah, I feel like they made a mistake with how they started this demo. Symphony. Hades update really changed the art direction. <laughs> Would you say Wizard of Legend One is is very uh, Hades esque? The demo should have started with this. Like, I don't know why it started where it did. This feels way better of a starting point. I was kind of put off by the start. Having a little cutscene with the little bird gremlins, getting some voice acting, getting a little introduction to the world. Like, that felt so much better than just being plopped in. And now we got a little guy commentating on stuff. Oh, that spell pulled my enemies in, but didn't stop their bolts. Time is a chance to critical heal. What's well, a critical heal? Cryptic escape. What kind of game is it? Increase your damage by 10%, increase max HP. I'm gonna go for a straight up 10% damage boost. Across the board? Why not? I like this man. He gives me only good commentary. I like him. I think him and I will be good friends. Did I miss a path? Why is there no map? Maps should be <laughs> mandatory in these games. I believe yesterday we were talking about games where you have to do, like... We were talking about Rift Wizard 2 and, like, having things you can only get by doing certain elemental damage. This is the game I was trying to remember. Not this, but the first one. Rift Wizard 1... Not Rift Wizard. Wizard of Legend 1 had chests that, like, if you wanted to open it, you had to do a sequence of elemental damage to it. Like, lightning, earth, and then water if you wanted to open certain chests. I knew there was something in my memory in there. Just remember everything always. <laughs> Gotta earn the basics. Feels like the biggest difference between the first game and this game is there's a lot more random stuff. Like, we can get a 10% damage boost. There's an alternate way to heal, that kind of stuff. The first game was very much, you have five slots for spells you find spells as you play there wasn't too much in the way of like getting like weird sigils and like stat boosts you can get like uh relics that'll give you little boosts whoa replace it with the diamond standard why ever would we do that it's a bit rogue likeier now I don't- I don't know if I like the pull all the enemies into you spell. If their attacks are going to keep going. 
feel like they need to be stunned if I'm gonna suck them on on to me. Have them piled on top. Just gold in there? Just gold. I do feel like these guys should have dialogue. Killing enemies using your signature arcana increases its damage. When an enemy comes out of shock, dashing through enemies will damage them. All burn effects are powerful. Slamming fractured enemies in the walls will massively damage them. What are you buying? Yeah, this guy should have voice. <laughs> Thank you. Not enough cash, stranger. buy something. But I'll just keep saving my money just in case we find a different shop with better stuff. Oh! I was going for Symphony of Night. <laughs> Thank you. We regret this error. Battery of Tanars. Increase all your lightning damage by 15%. I'll pick it up. For tools, be ready. If the wizard drops that relic, I want it on my desk immediately. It's mine, though. No, wait, I came from here. I went left there. All that is gold. Does not glitter. This stuff is shiny, though. Yeah, I'll just keep saving money. There might be a shop on the next floor. Ah, oh, hell, unless it's a boss fight. I should have bought a thing. Let's beat him up. Nazradine, how do I zoom in on the remains? I thought he was dead. Thank you. Arcane Chromo acquired. The Garden Arcana variants, wielded by Aengzian to mask the wizards. These forgotten variants are altered versions of Arcana. They offer new and more potent magic, empowering the wielder to overcome trials. Variants can only be discovered during runs and are lost upon wizards' demise. Magnetizing Spear. Pull and shock enemies. Dash forward before summoning an air vortex. Frenzied Knuckles. That's a, a variance on Knuckles the Echidna. Pummel foes with giant earth fists. With each hit, attack speed increases. I, I like the Magnetized Spear, because I've also upgraded my lightning damage. So, like, that just kind of tracks. About your enhancement, please fill out the questionnaire in your role for us to retrieve it later. Shwum. Do, 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 do. I don't respect signs. Your gold does.
wasn't tarnished. Oh. Gold under 18 carats will burn. This is why gemstones are superior. Hold on now. Hold on. Y'all just gonna stand there and let me kill you? That's fun. Explains a few things about your taste in music. Yeah, you. Do, 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 do. Uh ah. -huh. That thing. Dooku, Dooku. All right. No sides. Nothing there. I want to find another one of those, like, wizards. Ow! That's right. Man, I feel like I want to go back the other way. Depends on the type of wizard. Did you at least stop to appreciate the designs on that pot? Arcana shot. Fireball, ice blast, ultimate Tiamat. Terror ring. Gust volley. I mean, I've seen ultimate Tiamat. I guess I want to see the gust volley. Projectile. So B is basic. X is signature. Which is odd because you would think S would be signature. And S, I believe, even though S should stand for signature, I think it's just special. Because it it's going to go in my R2 slot, I believe. Why is this one all sparkly? Guess I'll buy this one. I got the money for it. The prices don't make any sense to me. This is a basic S starter spell goes in your primary slot it feels like the cheaper ones are better mayor of constitution doubles any max hp boost received from other relics 10 percent more damage for each status effect on enemies gain a shield that freezes nearby enemies on being hit killing fractured enemies with a fire arcana will cause a level 3 burning explosion increase all your water damage by 20% Hmm. I mean, this one's got, like, a, a special thing in it. I'll, I'll buy this. Even though I want to see the other ones. I don't know why it's so special. Wish there was a map. So I could quick travel 
Go and look at other spots without having to walk there. Life's misfortune can strike without warning. The destruction of a chaos gem is a dangerous thing, so do not destroy them. Give them to me instead. What are you? What is this? 10% critical chance. Magnetized spear plus 35 critical chance. Extra damage to elite enemies. That's the one I would like, but I'll take the just free one, I suppose. That upgrade didn't shock you when you grabbed it, did it? <laughs> we did it. Uh, I guess we could just teleport to the last room. But I want to see if there's anything I missed. Like this? I guess I was supposed to break that. Hope that's what I was supposed to do. What do you got for me? All right, that might be it now. I have no idea, but I feel like it. Have a good one, line. Oh, no, there is a thing we missed. Look at this man. Some kind of frog wizard. A frizzard. I could trade an Arcana, honestly. I, I wouldn't mind trading this one. Stone Strike Kick. Ice Blast. I mean, I've seen that one. Haven't seen this one. Propels you forward. Fracture. Yeah, let's take that one. Thanks. I wonder what its ultimate version will look like. And we're teleporting. Some kind of bug man boy. Got a couple of heals on it. That's kind of like the first game. There were always heals outside the boss arenas. Hey, kiddo! His health bar is a, a thick one. Forward, ah. esteemed audience, for the show What's that go. bar under his health bar? Is that a stagger bar? I think he has a stagger bar. I think they put a stagger bar in here. That's definitely a stagger bar under his health bar, isn't it? One, four. Took 20 minutes to get there. Unclip my headphones. No. Cinnabon? Eh. 
They stole it from Sekiro. Lilaron, Dagger of Midas, defeating enemies with basic attacks, rewards you with golds. Cinnabon, attacking burning enemies with lightning arcana, resets the burn duration. And then Andratar, the Berserker Sandwich. After being hit, there's an opportunity two seconds to heal yourself by hitting the enemy. Each hit heals you for 10%. Well, that's even more Sekirog. It's got like the rally mechanic here from uh, Bloodborne. I like the artwork on the burger. I still feel like I prefer the art style of Wizard of Legend 1 more still. This uh, current art style, it, it harkens back to like... Almost like Blizzard's style for Warcraft a little bit. Chunky, colorful fantasy polygons, which are fine, but... Like the first game had quite a style to it, and this... I, I want that back almost. You do something now? Apparatus oversees the trial rules by utilizing, utilizing Chaos Gems. It grants a diverse array of permanent buffs during the trials. Increase the maximum health of wizards. 5% chance to drop small signature globes in fights. Each rank boosts the chance of an additional one by 1%. Wizards can perform an extra dash on pits. Increase the starting gold amount. Each rank boosts the funding by 25. This is the second demo. The first demo is Red Snow. A SSS tricky style snowboarding game. But also you have shotguns, samurai swords, grenades, and there's a bunch of, a bunch of other ninjas snowboarding around. Wait, I got 60? 60 gems to spend? And I have one one swirly globy thing. I don't know what the swirly globy thing is. The last wizard got absolutely demolished by Bahadur the Giant. That guy could have one shot at the wizard if he ambushed them properly, but he held back until they approached his kid. I guess he's fighting to defend his family. Too bad he's doing it on the trial grounds. That was me. I died. He's talking about me. Look, Dustopius. Among all the items in this mansion, a wizard has spotted us. I suspect, my dear Romeo, <laughs> that it's our unexpected motion that has caught the wizard's attention, rather than us as sentient objects. What a horrible fate. It's better to be noticed for any reason than to be forgotten. Lost among these relentless dusts, these footprints of time. Greetings, by Shuffle wizard. dirt into my you mouth. I wish you success in seizing the chalice of immortality. Is that what we're doing in this trial? Should the wizard's corpses linger in the trial's levels? Never. Fetch the bodies and channel their chaos gems into the apparatus for all wizards' benefit. Just follow the corpses in there. Bahadur is not a foe to be taken lightly. The last wizard learned that lesson a bit too late. That is why I am telling you this right now, so you can go into the trials prepared to face him. You didn't tell the last wizard, though, did you? Let that guy die. Yo, wizard. Heard anything about the last one who made it to the end of the trials? Faced Hieronymus and vanished? That poker face means you're clueless. Since you're playing the silent game, let me spill some tea. Yeah, spill the tea, lady. I'm so not enjoying this forest internship for my Aunt Mulan in this mansion. The only thing keeping me sane is the apparatus. Give this gizmo a whirl. Just don't tamper with it. Because then it's me who's got to do the fixing. Am I exhausted dialogue here? Get 
At last, Nazreddin. I'm not ready to come out and give a speech to improve your child's show. I want to meet the bird. All right, just because things changed in between. Just one more. One more. Try some more spells. Fist was nice. We'll try uh, Wind Fingers. No, no, no. Terror Ring this time. And... Wait a minute. Stone Strike Kick. Oh, I guess that means I've tried them all now. I'll go back to that one. And I haven't seen this one. Why do they take damage randomly every once in a while? Is that when they teleport back? Alright, at a certain range that happens. Three, two, one. Ah. That's the one. Alright. I imagine that's where we change our robes, like in the first game. All right, wizard, listen up. I'm your eyes and ears from the observatory this time. Oh, the, the other guy's not going to be hosting? Me holding your hand. Remember, I'm watching. I'm watching. Uh, looks like we're diving headfirst into some action. Hey, hey! You've emerged victorious. And what do those things do? Get too cocky. There's plenty more challenges ahead. I think those fill my meter up faster. Yeah, it's nice to have multiple people narrating your events. A little flavor. Actually, not sure what's going on with those orbs. Oh yeah, they definitely fill the meter. Even when I was a little boy, I knew I would eventually find money inside the house. Now you're living my child self's dreams. How does How's it feel? <laughs> <laughs> and bang 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 the wind punch seems very effective but it doesn't feel very fun it doesn't feel very magical gain a shield that freezes nearby enemies when you hit pushing 10 enemies in the pits will reward you with 200 golds and then you lose it forever. Every time you get hit, an explosion shocks nearby enemies. Hmm. I mean, buying stuff means seeing more stuff. But I don't have great pushing people things right now. So I guess I'll take Frost home. If it works on the boss, that'd be very handy. The trials are only going to get tougher from here. And I'll be here to supervise from a comfortable distance. 
from a safe and comfortable distance. Did I miss any other pathways? This is why we need map. The glory that is map. This is the first pathway that emerged. Nope. Let's -a go. Give me my orb. Orb's nice. That's right, no more skeletons for you. I've already pushed two people in the pits. Three people. Four, god damn it. Five, I could have had 200 golds. Where's that orb? Five people bits. Ah, ah, ah. Earth knuckle stone. I feel like these are all the spells they have in the game. I'm starting to get that impression. I mean, if I can get nine more, I do like the lightning spear. Having it on a different button is going to be annoying, but... Can we change up how our spells are arranged? Maybe. I get that Nazbradeen spent all his time designing your trials, but aren't the enemies doing all the Well, it is work? a demo. It's true that it's a demo, but at the same time... I feel like you want to have a few more spells? Especially because I saw an enemy using a different spell that we don't have access to. Is that... is that not the end of the level? It doesn't say teleport to end. Is that a random teleport? That's the end. What's that thing do then? I'm not gonna break the health gem because if that's the exit, we're gonna be going there later. I have to take that red teleport and see where it goes. No potions in this game. Don't lie. Hitting frozen enemies with an earth arcana will damage all enemies around the target. All right, so why into B? Use that relic. First you grab it, then you punch someone with it. The goal is to demonstrate the mechanics. I feel like the first game demonstrated most of the mechanics already. Cursed Relic Shot. Your basic arcana deals 40% more damage, but all your other damages are decreased by 
Receive 20% less gold, but you lose 3 gold with... Wait, receive 20% less damage, but you lose 3 gold with every hit taken. Everyone moves 50% faster. Your max HP is reduced by 25% to summon an undead creature that fights beside you. Creature respawns at each level if it has died on the previous one. Mm. Reduces any healing received by 20%. You will gain gold equal to the same amount. Interesting. Chip golden armor is pretty nice, but also the cursed skull is pretty nice. How much health do I have? Hundred and something. Take the cursed skull. Everything is a tool that you can use to your advantage. Oh, it's a weird dog. That all means to an end. Come, my dog friends. Oh wait, went the wrong way. He's a good boy. Where was that shop at? Good work, boy. Make sure your wallet doesn't have a hole. You'll be scattering coins like breadcrumbs. What? Look at that good boy. Where was the shop? This is where the start was. This way, this way is the shop. Yeah, I like the lightning spear. Come, dog. Got a nice rounded selection of damage types now. Wait, I don't have to walk there. How does it feel mechanically compared to Wizard of Legend 1? Uh, very similar. Like... If I had to think of changes, there is no, like, real cooldown on dashing, and dashing's no longer a spell. So, like, mobility is apparently more of a focus now. Spells, though, feel very similar. My only real complaint is I do have trouble, like, the UI is quite small down, down there, over there. And the cooldowns, like, you're fighting something. I don't want to look all the way down there at a tiny thing to see what my cooldown is. But the little pop-up helps. Piece of candy, huh? <clears throat> Let me find out what my candy's going to be. Ugh. Today's candy is called Millions. It comes from the UK, because I, I have United Kingdom Universal Yums here. They are black currant flavored millions. Tiny, tasty, chewy sweets. Black currant flavored. So for you uh, European types, you might be familiar with these. I did a terrible job opening this thing. Got my hate. Okay. Let's see what a black current millions are like. Oh wow. Mm. I mean they said it was gonna be chewy. I don't know why I'm surprised. Pretty good. We both know you can smash them to pieces, so make it happen.
Really? You beat up my dog? I can't believe it went after my dog. RK and Chromo? Here we go. New things, perhaps. No, no, it's just upgrades to things. Twin spears. Throw a spear of lightning that damages makes the target airborne. Inflict shock at the point of landing. Two charges. Hold to powerfully pound the ground to summon a cascading ring of earth spikes. Critical damage at full. The wind carries you swiftly to your opponent, where you can unleash a flurry of punches and kicks. As the Kama reaches its peak, channels the remaining energy into a focused wind-charged thrust. Hmm. Airborne enemies are lifted defenseless from the ground. They remain airborne while they're being hit. Get a critical on full charge. Mm. Kind of want to see this. Comes with multiple statuses. And it has two of it? Yeah. Maybe the letters don't mean what I thought they meant. Because they all have B, but like... Only one of them is a basic spell. Basic. I thought this one was uh, a special. Upgrade this one. Keep leveling up like that, and you'll be casting with your eyes closed soon enough. Please do yeah, not two. start doing that, wizard. Double spear. Come, my undead dog friend. This is going after little spiders. If you find anything good in the rubble, don't tell not with me. I loved it. My dog's health. Stop hurting my dog. Hmm. I think I'll trade in my, my windy punch. Like, if I'm gonna punch, I might rather have the rock punch. I could trade in a relic. Okay. After being hit, opportunity of two seconds to heal yourself by hitting enemies. Gain a shield that freezes. Hitting frozen things with Earth Arcana. Hmm. Let's trade in the Frost Helm, see if we get something good. Golden Tear Stone. Losing HP will reward you with golds. Deal 10% more damage for each status effect on an enemy. Attacking slowed enemies with water will freeze them. Killing a fractured enemy with fire causes an explosion. Ah, uh, I don't have any fire arcana, so that doesn't do anything for me. I have no water arcana, so that does nothing for me. We can, in fact, inflict a couple of status effects. Losing health gives you golds. Guess I'll take 10% more damage per status effect. Not gonna lie, that relic looks kind of tasty. Kind of tasty. I do like the frog. Frog had many deals, many good deals. You take frog deal? <laughs> My goofy ass undead dog here. Alright. 
This way. There are walls. Are there enemies? There we go. Now things are starting to get good. Where are my snacks? Yes, yeah, snacks. All right, what do we got? 10% more damage, 70% critical damage, 70% critical damage. Hmm. I mean, this is our basic ass attack. We use it the most. 70% more critical damage is pretty nice, but I don't know what my critical hit chance is. And I'm still unsure on what the letters mean. Although this is still the signature spell, so if X is signature, special basic, maybe, but I've seen them in different contexts now, so now I don't know. Hmm. I think I'll take 70% more damage on crits, because I do use this one pretty often. It has a quick cooldown. We have two of them, so it's hitting often enough that we should see some crits go off, especially on bigger bosses. Can you summon a glorious feast? Now that's true power. Now that's true power. Where'd my dog go? Did you kill my dog? My dog was at full ass health. Where is he? No way did you kill my dog. I don't know if that dog was worth 20% of my health. Let's remember that's there. Going on, Jim. Should throw you a party to celebrate that kill. Allie got me a noisemaker. This is Wizard of Legend 2's demo. Does that mean that Hades ripped off Wizard Legend 1? People keep on making this comparison. Is it just because it's 3D? I got a hundred whole gold here. Woo! Release a volley of piercing wind and a cone. I could take... No, that replaces the signature. I want an S. I need 50 more gold. Basic attacks add a stackable buff that increases the damage of your next standard arcana. Warrior blood. These all have X's next to them. Is it a rarity thing? A slow fireball throwing heavy damage hand fights near you. I want, I want, I want that. Can I find 50 gold somehow? Something like that. Moolin wouldn't leave me alone with any dishes for a week. I don't think. Was there another path? I know there was a healing gem that I was like, I'll come back to that later.
Ain't no way I'm gonna find 46 gold, right? With the narration of the soundtrack, that's true! The first game didn't have, like, any narration. I still prefer the art style of the first game. Man, I'm not gonna find any, am I? Oh. Feels like if you want to be able to buy things. Because I've only done a trade. I haven't actually purchased. I feel like you need that meta progression just so you start with more gold. Alright, I think I'll teleport back. Yeah, here's the frog. Alright. I don't want to replace my special or uh, maybe I'll... St I might replace my primary. I was really hoping to get another spell, though. Some merchants are better stocked than others, but none of them get discounts. Basic attacks had a stackable buff to increase the damage of your next standard icon. I mean, maybe I'll just take this. 35% more damage. Especially because it's like a combo. I have rapid hits. If we could just build up the 35 and then swamp them with another spell, that'd be good. Just grab that. Better than not spending money when we're going straight into a boss fight. Made some chili. Chile. My dog! That was it? That was the whole stagger bar? Right, three. Fuck. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. That stagger bar goes away very quickly. But we did better that time. Looks like he takes a lot more damage during the stagger, but it's a very brief window. Undamaged enemies take double damage. Dealing a critical hit to enemies heals you. Receive 12% less damage. Psy man. That choosing a starting wizard that has starting little thingies kind of reminds me of, uh... That whatchamacallit. Rogue Legacy. It said, use chili powder instead of chipotle powder. And you forgot to add tomato paste. Mmm. Apparatus actually create the stages of the trials. You don't say. You don't let the fact that Mulan brought this talentless girl here and I had to put her on apparatus duty for her internship make you think she's doing anything special. She just presses a button and after wizards die, the apparatus pulls in new chunks of land from various realms into the trials. Isn't it? Beautiful. Truly beautiful. Don't let her incompetence cloud your understanding of the apparatus's beauty and function. <laughs> I have been trying to, like... Figure out how to articulate that kind of thing, True, I assume. Like, it feels like they put a lot of effort and resources into trying to give this a personality. But it feels like it has less personality than the first game. Like, I don't... 
I don't quite get it. There's something about it that's just off to me. Like, when you're playing it, like, it feels like the first game. You know, very quick, responsive, each button corresponds to a spell, they all have cooldowns. I'm enjoying the idea of, like, changing the direction spells go as you play, because the first game was much more along the lines of, would you like to replace one of the spells? This one, it's more, hey, you want to change this spell to do X or Y or Z? And that's neat. Yeah, we're gonna spin the wheel. I'm gonna see what's going on in the lobby here. But I, I, because this is a sequel, I have thoughts. Yes, like, I, again, I feel like the first game had a great style and a fun personality. And it almost feels like this one's aping a personality that's not its own. I, I said before, but like, some of the animation and models and moments, like, they strike me more as like a Blizzard style sense of humor, like the kind of gags I expected in like Warcraft 3 in quieter moments. Or stuff from Hades, a game that I am not particularly fond of and don't have enough uh, knowledge to talk about. I must admit, Dystopius, this constant labor feels oppressive. Why should work dominate our existence? Oh, my dear Brumio, work isn't just a burden. It's the means by which we right? like, our purpose. Blizzardy bits. Our presence in the world. Blizzard by way of the Bastion narrator in Hades Hub, yeah. Maybe so, but at what price? Are we to be forever bound to unceasing toil? Balance is key, my friend. We shape our work as it shapes us. A wise person once told me that true freedom is achieved by finding harmony in our efforts. Dear friend, I'd like to see if your wise acquaintance would maintain that view after laboring with Madame Moulin for a time. I feel like you're a mean wizard if you sit down and you're like, today I'm going to make a sentient broom and dustpan. The observatory is what lets us watch you during the trials. We monitor everything here, and in time, these recordings will be broadcasted to viewers worldwide. Can you stand and watch? Of course not. Only Sergic, Nasruddin, the great Hieronymus, and I have that permission. Although Master Hieronymus has currently locked themselves in their room. And last bit of dialogue. That's like the silhouette of Tim the Wizard from fucking, uh... Monty Python on the Holy Grail. Alright. Weird. Weird. Weird stuff. Like... Enjoyable. Enjoyable overall. But like, something about it just feels strange and not quite right.